Hello everybody, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to download and install Cobblemon 1.7 for Minecraft Java. So, let's get started. The first thing you wanna do is go to your web browser, and I will have a link in the description that you have to go on, as this is a repository, so this will only really show up with a link, it's not really indexed on Google, so that is the one downside of this thing, so just go in the description and click the link, and once you enter in the link, it should look something like this. Now this is basically all the Cobblemon betas, and that includes 1.7. So basically, it should look like this, and what you want to do here is go and search, and from there you want to go to keyword, and you want to type in Cobblemon, so Cobblemon, like so, and here you want to enter, and here you'll see a bunch of different files. Now, the one that you want is the top ones, so basically the way this works is that you want to do last updated here, I want to click this thing, until we go latest, there you go. So here we have all the new ones, and here you should see Fabric and Neoforge. So this is the different Cobblemon versions. So we'll get yourself Fabric, so I'll be using Fabric for today's tutorial. So we click this, and now you'll see this page here. Now, what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna link the specific one in the description as well, if you want to be sure it works for you as well. So here what we have here is jar files, these ones here. Although, it is this one which works. This one is sources, it will not work. But this one will work. So, make sure it has a little Java icon, you can read through this, and it is .jar, like this. All you want to do here is just click this button thing here, and it will bring you to this page. This is the page I will have linked in the description, so you can access directly on this. So what you want to do here is simply go to the link here, the little hyperlink, and this will just download itself. So, there you go. If we go on our downloads here, we are downloading Fabric here. So, couple months Fabric 1.7.0, that's the version name. And this will be running on Minecraft 1.21.1. So, this also requires Fabric API, which we will get soon. So, I'm gonna download this first, and then we'll go and get ourselves Fabric API for 1.21.1. So, now that we have Cobblemon, all we need to do here is simply go to a new tab and we need to go to our search bar to go on modvinf, like so. Here we enter and you will see modvinf.com, just click on modvinf and this will bring you to the modvinf homepage. From there all you want to do is go to discover content and you want to go down to mods. Now you want to go on fabric api, so it is here. If it doesn't show up here, just go ahead and search for it, but it should be somewhere here. So just go ahead and click on the name. Here you want to go to versions. And now you want to go to game versions and you want to choose 1.21.1. And this is all the versions that you can choose. Although just select the latest one here. So we'll get a release for 1.21.1 fabric. So just do the green down button here. And as this is fabric, we also need to get ourselves fabric Minecraft. Which is simply by going to a new tab and going to your search bar, Fabric Minecraft, like so. So, just go to new tab, search up Fabric Minecraft, enter, and you'll see FabricMC.net here. Just click on Fabric, and from there, you'll be on the Fabric homepage. Now, all you want to do is go to the blue download button, and now you want to go to the blue download for Windows button here. And now, you also have Fabric Launcher here. So, here it is, FabricInstaller.exe. So now we have everything we need to get Cobblemon 1.7 to work. So what you have to do here is just close your web browser and here you want to go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. Now all you want to do is double click the fabric installer. From there what you want to do is go to the Minecraft version section and you want to click this and click 1.21.1. So this matches this, this and this and now you can do install. Okay, and close. And now all you have to do is simply go to the Minecraft Launcher. With the Minecraft Launcher, this is how you open up Minecraft Java, and this is how we're going to add the mods to the mods folder. So the way this works is that once we have Minecraft, like so, we will see that we have Fabric Loader 1.21.1 here, and all you have to do is simply 
go ahead and go to installations here. Here you'll have to hover over fabric loader and go to the folder icon. Now all you want to do is find a mods folder, like so, and you want to double click it. Now all you want to do is go to downloads, and you want to go ahead and select and copy the two mods, and then you want to go to the top left arrow to go back to your previous folder and click paste. And now you have Fabric API and Couple Mods Fabric 1.7 in the DOM Minecraft Mods folder. So once you have this, you can go to the Minecraft Launcher, you can make sure that you go on play, make sure also that you have Fabric Loader here selected, and click play. And now all you have to wait is for everything to download and open. Okay, so once we have Minecraft here, all you want to do is go to a single player world and let's do create new world and let's create a new world with Covermon 1.7. So here all I have to do is go to creative and then we can do create new world and this will create a new world for us. So all you have to do here is just wait a couple seconds and there it is. So now we have Covermon with Minecraft and here we can see that we indeed have Cobblemon as we can see that there's a bunch of Cobblemon related things that shows up like so and we can go on M here there is different styling Pokemons we can choose as well of course and there's also in the inventory here we do page 102, 202 here we have a bunch of Cobblemon items that we can choose from now I'm not too familiar with the Cobblemon mod itself, so I'm not too sure if there's anything different or not from the last version, but if you are a bit more, maybe you just noticed something different from last one. So there you go, I can go through all these, and yeah. So yeah, that is how we get ourselves the Cobblemon mod 1.7 slash 1.7.0 for Minecraft Java. So, if you liked today's video, make sure to like and subscribe, and see you for the next one. Bye!